ever wonder how much it really costs to raise 500 catfish juveniles that is catfish that is within 10 grams each to a table size weighing one kg or more within the time frame of uh, four to five months stick around as we break down the hidden costs behind this fish farming process 500 juveniles to one kg we want each of our fish to reach one kg or more at the end of five minutes of rearing so in adama states a juvenile goes for 18 era averagely so we are using 18 era for our calculation so 18 era time is 50 it will give us 40,000 era so you are purchasing your juveniles 500 juveniles from a reliable hatchery that has a good history of uh, good and quality fingerlings and juveniles you buy from them at that rate then you stock it in your ponds so these are the feeds that these 500 fish will consume within four to five months as you feed them intensively they they are expected to consume about 33 bags and we are using blue crown as our example for this video yeah i personally use blue crown that is why i am using blue crown for this video so we will need two bags of 2 mm of blue crown and 2 mm goes for 28000 naira so 28000 naira by 2 it will give us 54000 no 56000 naira naira so we will need four bags of 3 mm and it also goes for 28,000 Naira. So 28,000 Naira time is 4. It will give us 112,000 Naira. We will need uh, 12 bags of 4 mm of blue crown. And uh, 4 mm goes for uh, 27,000 Naira in this part of the country. So 27,000 Naira time is 12. It will give us 324,000 Naira. And uh, we will also need 15 bags of 6 mm and uh, 6 mm goes for 26,500 naira time is 15 it will give us 397,000 naira 500 yes the the reason why our 6 mm the bags is high because at this time or at this stage of our fish we want them to weigh we want their weights to increase that is why we are increasing the number of 6 mm to give them because 6 mm is basically for energy is an energy energy source feed from 4 mm downward is a protein high they are high in crude protein so it's in ensure that your fish grow fast uh, to a certain length or size size that will be appealing to your customers and uh, since they are going to wait in order to buy it from us we want to give them uh, this 15 back so that they will all weigh uh, one kg and one kg plus so let's also put that uh, you are paying a farm attendant who will come in the morning in the afternoon and in the evening just to feed your fish probably you are a civil servant that goes to work from nine and return back home by five so you will need someone that will feed your fish in the morning or afternoon and night so let's say you you put the farm attendant on the ten thousand naira monthly so by five months we have fifty thousand naira. so miscellaneous you want to buy drugs of course fish does not easily fall sick especially if you have good management practice you ensure that your water quality is up to optimum your sorting practices are standard then you are good to go you will not spend much so let's say for our miscellaneous we are uh, budgeting hundred thousand naira because during harvest you also need more hands in harvest so that uh, you have a good harvest period so hundred thousand naira so let's put these values together don't forget we purchase our juveniles 40,000 naira plus the total cost of our feed which is 889,000 naira 500 goes for feeding 
and uh, for our farm attendance we have 50,000 Naira and for miscellaneous we have 100,000 Naira. So this sum is uh, 1 million and 79,500. This is the total cost of your production. So at 10% mortality rates, if you are good in fish farming, if you have all the technical know-how, uh, the highest rate of mortality that should be recorded within these five months should not exceed 10%. So let's say for, for, the, for the benefit of this video, let's say we have 10% mortality. Remember we stock 500 and now we are harvesting by 10% mortality, we are harvesting 450. So at the end of five months, each of our fish is expected to weigh one kg. So we are using one kg averagely for this calculation. So, okay, 450 times one kg. We have 450 kg. Good. So in Adama State, a kg of fresh fish goes between 3.5 to 4,000 Naira. Let's use 3.5 for our calculation. So since you want to sell them, you want to sell everything at once. You want to sell cheap so that they will resell and make their own profit. So 3.5 times is 450. It will give us 1,575,000 Naira. Good. So this is your income at the end of the harvest. So minus 1,079,500 from this income, you have roughly about 400,000 Naira as your profit within four to five months. So this is the cost implication for raising 500 catfish juvenile weighing 10 gram to one kg. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you find this content interesting and you want to stick with us as we journey through the nitty gritty of our catfish farming. Just to show you that catfish farming is profitable if you understand the system. Thank you.